It's 7 p.m. Pacific, 10 p.m. Eastern, and it's time for the show that brings you the best deals in vaping. Broadcast from the Vapor Joe's Bunker in the heart of New Jersey and coming at you from the Vaping Underground Live Network on YouTube. I'm your host and deals diva, Tiger Tiger, and with me, as always, is the infamous, proudly politically incorrect, and always devilishly handsome Vapor Joe. So grab a vape, a beverage, and don't touch that dial. You're in for 90 minutes of interactive, informative, and money-saving vape chat. At. Welcome to Done Deal. Oh shit! Sorry, Joe. You're unmuted. You can talk now. Hey, <laughs> can you guys hear me? Hello. Bloody hell! <laughs> it's Sorry, just, it's just a... been that kind of evening. Um, I don't. I, I'm looking at the broadcast now, and for some reason, I'm in widescreen. God knows why. Uh, I'm happily listening to the end of Phil's show, thinking I got all my shit together, and all of a sudden, my audio driver tells me it crapped the bed and I have to reboot, so we did that. Then when I load up XSplit, for some reason, it just decided out of the blue to load a presentation from, I don't know, like 1997 or something insane, and uh, so it's just been a, it's been a fun time getting, getting this uh, show on the road, but here we are now. So. Crap the bed. It's shit everywhere. There is Something. shit on the walls. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what the hell. Shit going on, on the on on the sheets. I, shit on the fucking bed. I, I don't know. I don't know what to say about this. It's real bad. And I'm just trying to figure out why it insisted on suddenly putting me in widescreen. I have no idea. I have no idea how to fix it. Um, maybe it's your VC. No, why would VC do that to me? It shouldn't. It, VC's not yeah. using the camera. Xplit's using the camera. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Uh, complicated, stupid computer shit. Okay. So anyway, guys, welcome to Done Deal. Um, you know, I'm going to start uh, having, when I do shows, I'm going to start showing people what, I, what I'm drinking. And today, <laughs> okay. I'm drinking one of these. These are awesome. I don't know if you guys ever had one of these. These are the 1893 Pepsis. Uh, this is the original recipe, but this is a ginger cola man this is so good impossible to find though i had to buy this shit on amazon i paid 11 dollars for 12 of them oh yeah really good okay they're telling you... they're, oh sorry go on oh well i was just gonna say they're telling me my vc my it is my vc and i don't know why because like vc doesn't have the camera right now screw off vc you know what it is i think vc itself is is shitting the bed i think um you know, it used to be good. Now we're getting a lot. We're getting a lot of problems. Yeah. We may have to go back to the old school Google Hangouts, or maybe we could use that new um, Google thing, that new Google Duo uh, uh, app that's out there. There's this. Uh, if you guys mm. didn't know, there's this new Google. Um, it's almost like FaceTime for uh, for um, for your cell phones. So cross platform. It's pretty cool. Anyway. Uh, somebody's asking, did you get the latest update for XSplit? Uh, no. No, I did not. Uh, I've been trying to get to that all week. Oh, you know what? Uh, it does... Let me try this. I don't know. Maybe this isn't wise to switch on the... Ah! <laughs> so there. See? I may be a little challenged, but I'll figure things out eventually. So there we go. All right. Nah. Ha, 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 ha. You okay there? Yeah. I'm just feeling kind of smug, that's all. There okay. we go. Okay. I'm using I'm using my non-traded in uh, Note 7 at the moment, ladies and gentlemen. I could yeah. blow up at any time. Don't 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 get me started. That that'll be another rant. <laughs> Bloody Okay, no. I'm going to say it. I'm going to say it. Why the fuck would I'm use Yeah, I said that. Uh, when I'm using a Note 7, can they somehow put a Note or, or a Note 5, they can put a Note 7 in the mail. Let me have both of them concurrently until I'm happy that I've got the 7 set up the way I want, and then i got to send back the 5. Why can't they do that now that they've screwed up with these Note 7s? I want both of them in my hand until I'm happy with the new unit, and then I'll send the other one back. But no, they don't want you powering up the one you have so they won't let you keep both of them. Well, you dumb shits, as long as I only have one of them, it's going to be powered up. So yes, but it holds them from liability. Also, they don't want you sending it in the mail, the old one. Well, I won't send it in the mail. And you know I'll be funny happy thing to is, drop it off when I'm finished stop. with it. Well, I, I agree with you there. They should be. They should do that. But, um, or they should do that. But if they offer that, what happens if you don't have a T-Mobile store near you? You know what I mean? 
that they'd have to offer that to everybody. Well, then you're really screwed anyway, because if you don't have a T-Mobile store, you're not allowed to mail them. So, hello, you know, like the problem is the same. That's, Listen, that's I'm, a, with, I'm with you on point. this. I'm, I'm with you on this, but my, but um, it's their fuck up, you know. Uh, and I think we're both supposed to get twenty-five dollar Visa gift cards, a whopping twenty-five dollars. <laughs> Can you believe that? A whole twenty-five dollars. Keep the damn gift card and build phones the way you used to with a changeable battery. Wouldn't that have been ever, ever so simple? Well, no, we have to blame ourselves for that because everybody complained it wasn't premium enough, so they had to build it with aluminum and glass to compete with the iPhone. And uh, now with aluminum and glass, you can't take off the back. They should I, have had some I kind of micro no hinge. Thing. They should have some kind of micro hinge system where they could have just you could have just opened it like a mod, you know, like. You know, or something, and and did the battery that way. But you know, that's that's smart. Stupid. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. Anyway. So so I'm a little cranky tonight, but everything's working now. There's nothing more I can do yes. about the stupid phone tonight. So now it's just all downhill from here. Or yes. well, all coasting. Not not downhill. Yes. That makes yes, it yes. sound bad. But. So uh, we have a lot to talk about tonight. I'm going to talk about the Android bankruptcy. Uh, we're going to do some date mail. Um, I don't know what I showed you last week versus what I got to show you this week. Uh, I know I we definitely got bait mail that we didn't show you last week because we just got it today. Yeah. Um, and, um, you know, of course, deals and all that other good stuff. We started a little late, so we may go a little late. Who knows? Um, but <laughs> Tiger's like, mm, no, <laughs> not going late. Uh, but uh, if, if, there, if you'd like to start with your bait mail, Tiger, did we talk about the Tarak tank last week? No, no, that showed up uh, 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 just after. I didn't talk about that, did I, guys? Yes. Did we talk about oh, this? Oh, no, yes, I did, and I'll tell you why I know that. Because I did the unboxing while you talked about it. I set it up. I actually used it for the first time on the show. So, But there is an addendum, guys. So I do want to talk about it again, if you'll give me a moment. I set this little baby up last week, you know, vaped it. It was like, hey, good flavor. Hey, you know, good vapor. Uh, seems like a decent tank. I'll keep using this. Well, guess what? I woke up the next morning and it had bled completely out. Uh, the stupid thing, there was juice all over my desk, all over my mod. Thank God it didn't get down inside, but it was a hell of a mess. And... Um, so I took it all apart, got it all cleaned up, uh, made sure the head was seated tight because that's always the first thing, you know, I check when something like that happens. Yeah, it was. There was just, you know, it was just a great big mystery. So I filled it up again. It started to leak out again. I got so fed up, cleaned it all up again, switched the heads, and it has been golden ever since. So Torek, still a win, but I would say maybe just keep an eye on it. Um... It seems like I just had a bad head installed, and uh, are the odds that you will? No, the odds are very much against that, but just be aware it's a possibility. So maybe, you know, keep an eye on it the first time you use it. Um, but like I say, since I changed out the head, I've had a couple tanks through it, no problems, uh, performing very nicely. So Torek, still a win, but one bad head, you know, that's them's the break. No such thing as bad head. Well, there is... There is... Never mind, I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. I have a little problem there. Uh, anyway, so... Um, so, yeah, the Turk Tank... I, I, I love mine. I've had zero problems with mine. You don't have... The, I have it on my... Um, I talked about this last week. I still have it on the 26650 DNA 75. It works. It's such a lovely little pair. Uh, but you know what I'm vaping in this? I'm vaping My Freedom Smokes Fruit Punch. Uh, I, I found it. You know, I have so much juice. Sometimes I'm looking for juice and I can't find it. My Freedom Smokes makes the best fruit punch, in my opinion, on the market. Uh, and it's just called Fruit Punch. Uh, and uh, I think the reason why I like this juice so much is because it's nostalgic. It's the first juice I bought after buying my first kit with the three Decang juices I bought. So I went over to My Freedom Smokes and picked up Fruit Punch. Uh, and uh, I guess that's why I love it so much, because it brings me back to, uh, to my early vaping childhood i guess is the word um but um it's a really really uh great great juice the all right so days. now we didn't talk about weirdo did we no so you talk about weirdo 
This is Weirdo Vape. Now, I was uh, really excited. People have been talking about this. This is Andy Hahn's uh, latest project. And um, he, he uh, we, we, we got some of this to try out. And uh, for those of you who don't know the flavor profile, that's it right there. It is nerdy, creamy candy. So you get a pretty good idea of what to expect. Uh, the fruity sweet but still a little tart taste of uh, reminiscent of nerds candy um, uh, on the inhale and the exhale uh, still that but a, a creamy finish so it's not it's not all bitey and sweet it's got a creamy nice smooth finish to it um, and and Big Bam's got the link for you there if you want to give it a try thanks Big Bam hi and uh, so yeah weirdo vape nerdy creamy candy not an ADV for me, but kind of yummy. And Joe, well, I'll let you say, uh, he was slower to warm up. Um, he wasn't sure he liked it at first, and now he's vaping it constantly. So, <laughs> um, It's funny, too. I just went over the website. The website is, you know, this is what I like. One liquid, the whole website, one liquid. And it's not that expensive. Um, am I still going? Am I, can you still hear me? Because I don't hear myself. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, you're muting. Okay, I see why. Uh, now, now, it's actually not that expensive. Uh, you'd think something by Andy would be expensive. It's 60 mils for $30, which is 15 for 30 which isn't terribly expensive considering it's one of these, you know, high posh Cali juices. Uh, now, if you buy, now uh, his coupon code buy two get one. So basically, it's buy two get one free. Uh, now, a hundred and let me see here. 120 mils is hold on, give me a sec. 120 mils is 40 bucks. Okay, so that's ten dollars for 30 mils. That's a good price, um, in my opinion. Now, if you buy two 120s, you're gonna get a 120 free. So now we're getting real cheap, but that's a lot of juice. So when I first tried it, I was like, eh, because it tastes like mango to me. Uh, but the more I vaped it, uh, and especially at higher wattages. That mango kind of went away, and now it's back to what it's supposed to be, this kind of candy. I was down in the 40-watt range. I kicked it up to about 65 watts on the shark tank, and now it's really getting more of that candy flavor, which is good, which I like. And I have vaped quite a bit of it now. It's actually quite nice. Now, D. Millen wants to know, is it sweet tartish? Um, yes. Uh I would say it's not a dead ringer for a sweet tart vape, but if, if you like that, like that candy-ish, but it's got that little bit of a bitey tartness to it, I think this might be a hit with you. Yeah, worth a try, definitely. Yeah, um, like, like I said, you know, it is 30 bucks for 60 mils. It is a, it is a <coughs> um, you know, an investment, I guess. 30 bucks is 30 bucks, you know? If you hate the shit, you're gonna be pissed, <laughs> you know? But um, if I were him, to roll out a new uh, juice, what I would do is um, not give ten, not give five mils away, but like charge a penny and and make them pay f the shipping cost, so he could send five mils to anybody who wants it. You know what I mean? That's what I would do if I was going to roll out a juice. Uh, but that's that on the weirdo. It's pretty good. Uh, but uh, we finally got our Labor Day, uh, our Labor Day um, uh, juices from Breezy. What happened was Breezy was waiting for my license to, put, to show that I was, you know, because you have to prove that you're blah, 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 blah. You're 18 or whatever. Um, and I sent them an email. I'm like, dude, it's me. You know who I am. Do I really got to send you my license? Um, what happened was something I bought was out of stock, and he had to wait for that to come in the stock. So what he did was he said, screw it. He sent it in two parcels. So Tiger got hers, and I got mine. So I'm going to start with Tiger. She got her favorite, one of her favorite e-liquids at a really good price. So go. Tie boba, tie boba, tie boba. That's 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 all you need to know. Uh, the whole boba line is great. You know, there's a there's a jazzy boba, there's a, a dewy boba, and the fourth one that I always forget. But tie boba, it is just so special. So um, if you've never tried any of the bobas, I would say definitely start with the jazzy and the tie and experiment from there. Really, 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 really good. And I have missed that. It's one of the few 30 mils I blew through so quickly and uh, almost, you know, shed a small tear when I squeezed the last drop out of the bottle. So I was really glad to get some of that back in. She got a good price because it can be a little expensive. Um, we picked it up for, I picked it up for $17.99 a bottle. 
which I think normally it's twenty two ninety five a bottle or twenty three ninety five a bottle. So I was like, all right, Tiger, it's on sale. Now Ty Boba comes from um um what's his name? Um Tiger, you know. Uh this. Lonnie. 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 That's the, yes. Yeah. yeah. Lonnie Bozeman, yeah. the guy who does the standard you and all betcha. that stuff. Uh so he um so he normally sells it, like I said, 23 or 24 or $22. We got it for 17 so we were happy with that. She, she picked up three. But I wanted free shipping. So what I did is I just went on a limb and, and went for something that I would be interested in. It's called Pie Shake. I just got it today. Uh, now, inside, I like the packaging on this. Inside, um, there are, oh, and over here, there are three... 30, three uh, unicorn bottles, 30 mils each. It was 90 mils. I think I paid 11.99 for 90 mils on sale. Uh, I'm vaping. I just cracked it and just filled the tank with it now, uh, and I'm like, I'm loving it. However, it's supposed to be um, kind of like an apple pie meets like a shake kind of thing. It, that's not what it tastes like to me at all. It tastes like a caramel, uh, a caramel apple. That's exactly what it tastes like. If you like caramel apple, you're gonna love this. Okay. Uh, again, it's called the pie shake, and they do a few other flavors. Um, so if you're into that caramel, uh, caramel apple kind of, you know, it's a good autumn flavor too. Um, you're gonna love it, and I love caramel apple. So I, so far, so good. I've baked about a half a tank of the Cleato of it, and it's it's pretty great. And for the price I paid, eleven ninety nine for ninety mils, totally worth it. I just wanted to get something completely out of my spectrum because I don't, I, I vape all the juice I get for free. Basically, it's re really rare that I'll go out and buy juice. And if I do buy juice, it's a juice I've been vaping for a long time. I don't try new things unless it's sent to me or, or it's something that's really really interesting. So uh, when I when I went to this company and got it, I was just like, oh, okay, something completely new, something different. Something, something completely cheese ball. This is a complete cheese ball. Okay, this is like that packaging that everybody gets pissed off at. I, I went completely that route, and uh, it's good though. It is good juice. Um, what else? Oh, and I don't think I talked about the new. I think I, I talked about the twenty six six fifty mod, but uh, what happened was my MX uh, MNKEs died basically. So I went out and I finally got my new. Emrin 26650s to go with the mod. So far, these blow away the MNKEs. Um, the one thing I was noticing with the MNKEs is by the time the battery got about half empty, I got a weak battery. It kept saying weak battery, weak battery. Like so, 40 watts. I couldn't even pay 40 watts on a half a battery. Uh, these Emrin 26650s power down all, almost all the way to the end. Uh, I, I can vape it. 75 watts. So um, I have an ideal. I'll throw it up a little bit later for these. Uh, they're on eBay. It's like 16.99 free shipping for two of them. So far, so good. They're holding up great. All right. Thank any you. any questions, Tiger? Um, well, there was one anti-hero wants to know if you know of any good deals on SX minis. No. No. You know, once Not in a while. That's not really good one. Eh? Once in a while, they'll do that. Uh, if you could find somebody with an, an older SX, like the, um, what was it, the um, 60 water or the 70 water, which is still a great, uh, I have one, uh, you'll get them cheaper, but uh, it's pretty rare uh, these days. The newer ones, like the brand new SX Mini, which is really hot, those are expensive, but I'll, I'll look for you, Anti. I haven't really been looking, so I will look for you. Maybe you'll get lucky. Wow. Uh, Wait, that that's didn't a, sound that, right. I was just going to say, <laughs> is that a new service from Vapor Joe's helping you get lucky? All right, listen, I'm drinking. Don't uh, don't make this stuff come out of my nose. <laughs> I think that would make for a great no, broadcast. No, no, because bubble, like soda coming out of your nose hurts. Oh. All right, don't, don't put me through pain. I've, I've had food come out of my nose from laughing. I literally had spaghetti come out of my nose once. I was like literally pulling out of my nostrils. Oh, wow. I think that's an overshare. <laughs> I, re I really do. <laughs> you know, and it didn't hurt as much as when a big, like, nasty amount of soda comes out of your nose. It burns like a bitch. Wow. Wow. I can't unhear that. Um, oh. Condi wants to know what I'm drinking tonight. I, I, I poured myself a shot of peach schnapps over ice. It wasn't a shot, guys. That yes, is it not was. a shot. Yes, it was. There's way more ice than, well, there was way more ice. Now it's melted. So now it's kind of peach schnapps in water, but it's good. 
Yeah, I told you you needed some wine tonight. I told you. It's not the same when you don't drink your wine during the show, but at least you have some kind of, we'll Why say, a, an alcoholic libation. Good grief. Are you telling me I'm not I'm not uh, entertaining unless I'm drinking? All right, somebody just threw up uh, Oh, Nick up your Labs. Yeah, that's the loss. All right, a couple things. Um, so... Now, we have a big uh, big announcement that uh, Enjoy is filing for bankruptcy. Yeah. Now, I actually went over to their website, and they're still... Now, you got to remember, bankruptcy doesn't mean they're closing, guys. Um, I, I don't know what bankruptcy they're doing, if they're doing Chapter 7 or Chapter 13 or, or Chapter 11. Um, 7 is complete liquidation, done, it's over, they're selling everything. Then you have another one. The other one is basically tells their creditors and, and investors, leave me alone uh, for a while while we, re we restructure. And I think that's maybe what they did. I'm just not sure because it's not really saying. But um, a lot of people lost a lot of money with them. Um, at one point, I was thinking about investing with uh, Enjoy uh, because they were doing so well. But I'm glad I didn't. Um, people from Pay, like co-founder from PayPal, invested into them. Um, the guy who, uh, who the original owner of Napster, invested in them. Uh, uh, Bruno Mars invested in them. Like millions and millions of dollars. At one point, they were valued at one billion, which is complete bullshit. Um, but people think this is because of the FDA. It has, this has nothing to do with the FDA. The problem with this is uh, they have a lot of debt. Right now, they're in that hole for two hundred thirty-four million dollars. This has nothing to do with the FDA. Okay, uh, and you ain't gonna spend, and you ain't gonna um, get out of a two hundred thirty-four million dollar hole by selling five dollar ninety-nine cent uh, uh, e six. It's just not gonna happen. Uh, now. Their biggest year uh, was, you remember the Kings? We actually gave a ton of those away, the little Kings that came in that plastic thing. Uh, in 2013, they made $93 million off the Kings, okay? Um, now, it's roughly about $8 million they're doing in the Kings. Uh, and I think what happened is Enjoy just didn't grow at the times. Um, they pissed away a lot, of, uh, a lot of money giving things away and sticking to this kind of sigil like thing and they lost their shirt because of it and it, like i said it has nothing to do with the fda um but there is something i'm going to be picking up for them i just want to try it they have these things called dailies um they're again disposable but they have a new soft tip and they have uh this new um uh if you're especially if you're craving a cigarette um they start out at uh four uh, four point five uh percent so 45 milligram is their basic one um, now you're like, oh my god, 45 milligram, that's a lot. Well, it is, but not for a delivery system like this. Um, they need higher nicotine levels because the delivery system basically sucks. Uh, but I still want to try them. They look interesting, and, and that rubbery, kind of soft end, I want to see um, if it compares to a cigarette at all. Um, and they're cheap. They're only $5.99 with free shipping. So I'm going to buy, pick up a couple of them, see how they are. Um, and, uh, you know, something just... Just to knock around with. I mean, I do like Sigalikes. It, it's funny when you see me with one. I actually the other day I busted out a few of them. Uh, it, Tiger's head kind of, <laughs> you know, kind of tilted because uh, I had some ones from Vapage from a long time ago that, that they were selling them for a dollar, and I still have a ton of them in the closet. So I busted one open, and um, and it was it was good. It still worked. And uh, I, you know, every once in a while it's nice to just kind of bust out and have a Sigalike. You know, it's. Uh, I don't know. What do you think, Tiger? Isn't it, it? They're cool, right? Oh yeah, they're handy. It's nice. I, I usually, well, I haven't got one right now, but I usually used to keep a, a brand new uh, cigarette -like in my purse all the time, just you know, just in case. And you know, you never know. Sometimes you'll run into somebody and want to give it to them just to get them to try it, right? Um, but they're handy um, and uh, and so simple. So I I like having them on hand just for those times when yeah. And, they're, and this daily is different than the regular Sigal Likes. Apparently, it's a different delivery system and stuff. So I'm, I'm curious. So I'm going to pick up uh, a few for myself. I'm going to get one for Tiger and Menthol, see what she thinks. Um, and like I said, they're so cheap, and it's free shipping, too. So it's $5.99 free shipping. Like, I, I'll buy, you know, four of them, you know, <clears throat> and just see how they work out. Well, um, there was uh, something came up in chat that I would love to interject into the show, Joe. I'd love to hear. I, I've already kind of weighed in in chat, but I'd love to hear what you have to say about it. Um, D. Millen, thank you for the link in the picture. I'm just going to put that up and share it with everybody. 
uh, because I, I want to have a, a record that I said this. D. Millen shared this picture with me and asked me what I thought of this new juice line. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it right here so that there's no mistake about what I think about this new juice line. You suck eggs, disappear, leave our community, leave our industry. Basically, <laughs> fuck off sideways. What's um, it called? Po- it's called Pokey juice? Pokey juice. And they have ripped off the characters and the characters' names. And not just blatant, disgusting copyright uh, infringement. Uh, let's talk about how that looks uh, as far as the FDA's what about the children uh, concerns. So, Pokey juice, two fingers straight up. Fuck you. No, no question. Is this American? Is this a Chinese outfit? Uh, that remains to be seen. Uh, there was one person, uh, I think Chevy in chat said he was going to do some research and, and find out. But um, basically, yeah, Shane says uh, Pokemon bullshit. It's a cash grab. Yeah, no of kidding. Of course it is. No kidding, right? I'm going to buy one. Uh, and, no, I'm going to get it. <laughs> and, and no, I would not try this. I wouldn't spend a dime. I hope they uh, go bankrupt. But anyway, there you go. That's what I think. Um, yeah, I, you know, it's... It's it's gonna happen, you know. Anything that's popular now, you're gonna you're gonna get juice made after it. And and I don't. It, to be honest with you, when did Pokemon Go come out? Um, that would have been I think the end of June. Uh, oh, okay. I'm trying to remember. I I I started playing on July 9th. I mean, I'm I'm thinking perhaps um, you know this might be a Chinese outfit only because uh, it'd be pretty hard to get the juice ready packaging and all that stuff between then and August but maybe they did I don't know but who knows um, mm. we shall see we shall see um, and I'm sure Chris Johnson will be all over it and, and anti will be all over it and all these other guys out there will be all over it so we shall see well An- anti tells me to try it first don't judge a book by its cover nope there is so much good juice out there that isn't uh, that isn't horribly bad for our industry I'll, I'll, I'll have I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll I mean, keep to that I can I could do without it. I mean, if they sent it to me for free, uh, I would try it, but I wouldn't spend any money on it. I uh, certainly wouldn't, um, and I wouldn't promote it either. Meaning, like, I wouldn't be like, "Hey, look at this new juice," but I would definitely uh, try it just to see what it's like for free. I wouldn't pay for it. Um, Tiger, on the other hand, would tell, probably take it out of my hand and set it on fire. But she throw it, she'd hit me in the head with a Pokemon ball, <laughs> knock me out, and then grab it from my hand and throw it in the garbage. No, no, I just give you dirty looks. That's all. Anyway, so, um, where were we? Oh, yeah, so uh, talk about the Android thing. Um, now, oh, I, I thought pre- you were done with that. That's why I segued. Oh, no, no, it's no big deal. I just, I just want to put it out. Last, last, last year, I predicted this stuff was going to happen with the big guys. Um, I knew the big guys were going to start having problems, uh, because they, they can't, especially the, what they're paying and, and all the things that they're doing and the advertisement and like I said, the Ferraris and the, the booth babes and the you know, thirty, forty thousand dollars a venue and all this other stuff. You're gonna just you're just gonna suffocate from your own weight. Um, and that's beginning to happen. You, you, and this one of them is Enjoy. Uh, you know, two hundred thirty million dollars in debt. I wonder why. You know, they could have probably saved uh, a lot of money not doing a lot of the advertising they did. And that juice line they did, uh, which is good juice, but they took the um, the quote unquote best juice makers and made that that, that the juice artisan. Line. Co- was it the artist yeah. or the artisan collection? Yeah. Artisan, yeah. artisan collection. I don't know what they paid them, but they lost their fucking shirts on that. But artisan collection, while the juice is very good, because uh, I, I was sent uh, a, a complete set of it. Um, <laughs> that shit. Was was when it first came out was really expensive yeah. and like I said they lost their fucking shirts and they probably paid a really really heavy price to each person to get their their faces on there and had to probably maybe sell the rights to a certain recipe or what have you so they could do it in their own labs they probably spent a ton of money getting that going and they didn't ever made it back you know you don't make an artisan collection and put it on a website that sells sickle eggs it's just not going to work <laughs> you know what I mean. But whatever, they just marketed it wrong. They should have came to me. I would have sold it very well for them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> anyway, uh, so that's that on Enjoy. Uh, their site is still up though. Like I said, I'm going to be trying out those some of those uh, weird little sickle likes that they have on their site. I'm, 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 I'm morbidly curious. I may even open one. 
to see what uh, the oh, lottery system looks like. Just in, a further to the artisan line, anti anti hero had a great point in chat. I think it's uh, worthy of mentioning, uh, and that is that it was old style juice, though uh, it didn't translate well to the cloud chasers, and and that's that's a good point. I mean, we have to acknowledge there's a lot of people that are really happy vaping uh, heavier PG fifty fifty or even more slanted to the PG, but you know a, a a big part of the industry now and that drives the industry are the the cloud chasers people who want a heavier vg content so that's a, that's a good point right and, right and the people who only people who are going to know the people on those boxes are people that are in the community that are probably yeah. cloud chasing yeah you know earl who's who's vaping uh you know a, a ce4 and a, on an ego twist has no clue who those people are on those boxes and um and doesn't though, care Right, and the juice will work in his little pen style, babe. But the people who are actually going to roll out the dough for the money—I mean, uh, roll the, the roll out the dough for the juice—want um, juice that's compatible with their devices. So they kind of did it bass backwards, or at least should have offered it in two different times. You know, like one the cloud line and a, and a regular line. All right, so let's start. Let's start talking about deals because it's it's already quarter to eleven. Oh my gosh! Well, we got a little bit of a late start with all my fun and games here, but so let's just start from the top. Um, all right. So here's the first one. Oh Bring man! It. Prick! Hold on, sorry. Give me a second. There we go. Start <laughs> from the top. All right. Now what this is is um, all DNA mods are twenty percent off. Uh, so if you guys are looking for uh, uh, DNA evolved DNA mods, uh, My Freedom Smokes is doing a deal now. If you go over to the site, for some reason when you click the link, it takes about ten seconds because I did a search, well, like a search for it. Uh, so it takes a little time. Uh, yes, I am eighteen. No, I don't want to fucking sign up to your email list. Huh. Anyway, they have a ton of different DNAs. Um, now, there are a few that there are some deals. Um, like, I do like the DNA 75 from Volcano, the lava box. Now, you'll see a lot of prices uh, are slashed. The, even though they're slashed, those are prices before the discount, okay? Uh, so if you wanted, like, the DNA 75, 20% off, it's going to be 79 instead of 99. Um, but the one I was really looking at, where are you? Uh, Yeah, there it is. It's the triad. Um, now, or the, uh, yeah, the triad. Now, believe it or not, Gearbest is sending me one of these. I don't know why. Um, but this, if, out of all the new DNAs that are out, this one was uh, was one that I was considering. And then uh, they hit me up. They're like, oh, we're going to send you one of these. I was like, oh, okay, <laughs> I'll, I'll take it. <laughs> you know, and um, it is a DNA 200. It's a little expensive, of course, but you're going to get the... Uh, 32 or 33 dollars off that price so it'll be like a hundred and change but you know it's a it's a real evolved dna you know what i mean and it's the one thing i love about the evolved dnas as much as i fucking you know me and uh brandon don't get along the owner of evolve i his chips are great uh they're safe number one okay um number two they're very accurate okay um they can be expensive that's the only problem there is a high premium, you know, the chip itself is 50 bucks. I mean, just the chip. So you got to work from there, you know? Um, so if you're looking for a DNA, but you just, you, you just can't afford it. I mean, now's the time maybe to take a look at, uh, revisit, uh, the DNAs and check it out over at, uh, my freedom smokes. Now also, um, they have a great, um, DIY section over there, nicotine flavorings. Um, and the reason why I talk about that is because Vaping Underground has such a wonderful DIY section. Um, I like yep. to talk about, you know, uh, the, the, the DIY section here. It's great. And you can pick up their Fruit Punch, which is fantastic. <laughs> and I think it's Vapor Joe's 13 will get you 13% off anything on that website. Okay, all the time, 24-7. That's a coupon that lasts forever. So whether you're going to buy a DIY or you're going to buy, you know, mods, tanks, whatever. Um, uh, use Vapor Joe's uh, 13 will get you 13% off. However, for this particular deal, I think it's DNA 20 will get you 20% off all DNA mods. So if you're looking at one, you might want to go over there and take a look. Right on. 
Yeah, I can't really talk much more about the animals. They're good mods. You know, they're just expensive. All right. Well, that one featured is gorgeous. I love the. I think it's pa Paula shell or. Yeah, and they don't even have that one on site. Oh, bummer. <laughs> you know, I'm like, oh, what's that one called? Oh, they don't have that one. It's a tease. Yes, um, and and lots of juice. Uh, we got lots of juice deals to talk about today too. Um, uh, juice dot deals is almost ready, so I can't wait till so I can start funneling all the juice deals over to there, and I have to worry about it on day for Joe's. Nice. All right, so. Let's start off with Central Vapors. <clears throat> all right. Now, Central Vapors is doing 50% off all their juice, every single one. Now, I've never vaped their juice. Oh, thank you, Big Man Boom. Uh, I've never vaped their juice, um, but um, I, I watched some reviews, uh, and they've been around a while. And uh, everything they have is 50% off. So have at it, people. Now, let's just see here. Uh, it'll bring 30 mils down to about 8 bucks. Um, now, 10 mils drops to 3 bucks. Okay? Hmm. Now, that's a great way to try their to juice. Try your I would, juice. Yeah. yeah, for sure. $3 samples, basically, it boils down to. That's awesome. Right. And uh, they have everything from Max PG to Max VG in different. Uh, at different uh, quantities. Now, I, my, my favorite's 50-50. That's the way I've always vaped. Uh, but, uh, and it looks like, let's see here, extra flavoring doesn't cost you extra money. Hmm. Okay, so if you want extra flavor in your in your juice, it costs, it costs the same. Uh, so that's a good thing. So what I would do is, if you haven't tried their juice, buy like, you know, five, 30, uh, five 10 mil bottles. That costs you 15 bucks. Right, of various different things that are in your flavor category, and try yeah. it, and you might find the, the uh, your newest great juice vendor. Right on. Okay, so again, fifty percent off. The coupon code is Super Fifty. Again, coupon code Super Fifty. Uh, it takes fifty percent off all their juice. Uh, I don't know how long this is gonna uh, um, uh, last, so there is no. Um, and I don't think it's even advertised on their site. Oh, Condi's got another money-saving great tip. He says, buy their sample packs. You can select each flavor, size, and nick level individually, and you get an additional discount for buying them in the sample pack. Great tip. Thanks, Condi. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Thanks, man. Um, now, uh, like I said, they're not even advertising this on their site. So you're in the know. Okay, so um, that's a that's a good little tip. So, like I said, I have no idea how long this is going to last. It can last tonight, into tomorrow. It can last two weeks. I have no idea. So, uh, get over there and jump on it. That's about all I can say. Okay, let's see now. They have some juices that are even cheap. They have some juices that are... Let's see here. Yes, let me see here. Um... Give me a second here. Let's go six milligram. Let's add it to the cart. Viewer at a cart. I got a coupon code, super 50. <laughs> okay, they got some juices that are $3.89 for 10 mils. Goes down to $1.94 for 10 mils. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, it's not a ton of flavors in that in the clearance section, but they have something called like Chamelon, which is like a big melon medley. Um, they have a uh, creamberry, another three dollar and eighty nine cent juice. They have a menthol. Oh, we know that one's. Oh, they have a strawberry colada for three dollars and eighty nine cents. A strawberry banana for three eighty nine. And, and let's see what else they have. Strawberry shortcake for three eighty nine. And a well, and that's it yeah, for the three eighty nine. So those go down to a buck ninety four. Cool. So, yeah, so try them out. Check it out. And they have a bunch of other mods and tanks in the clearance section. Check that out there. Can you go wrong for a dollar ninety four? Well, not really, no. I mean, even if it sucks, you can give it away somebody. <laughs> you know, if you think it sucks, you can give it to somebody. They may think it's great because I have tried juices that suck. Oh, and, and other uh, people I'm, love it. Like they're like, oh, this is great. I'm like, all right, man. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. So that is uh, Central Vapors. Enjoy. Okay, let's see what else we got here. 
All right, we got to bring this up because I believe this is the end. Uh, tonight is the last. Yes, it is the last. It, you only got one hour and nine seconds on this one. Okay. Oh so. my goodness! All right. Okay. All right, so uh, Lightning Vapes is doing a 20% off, 20 to 30% off all batteries and chargers. Okay, mm. so you battery geeks out there, um, if you're looking for uh, good prices on batteries and chargers, I just want to see. Uh, give me a second here. There we go. Thank you, Big Bam Boom. Um, yeah, now they have a bunch of stuff. Now, it's not just like when you click the link, it doesn't just, that's not their entire stock. That's just, you know, what's on the front page. Uh, but uh, they do have some good, uh, uh, good prices on uh, on certain chargers. Uh, like, let me see here. Um, oh, all right, that one's out of stock. Of course, that one's out of stock. Fucking prick. Now, my favorite charger, believe it or not, of all these is the LUC V6. I have that right here, it's sitting. I don't know if I can, yeah, I can. See, I have it. I have one battery in it right now, charging. But this is my favorite charger right now. The Bluetooth one is cool, but I've broken so many of the these things on it. I don't know how I did it, but like three of the six have busted on me. And I'm yeah, all... the spring goes. Yeah, but this uh, LUV6 is a great charger. It's great if you use VT uh, if you use RX200s because. It has six batteries, um, and uh, and you know it's just you know two setups plus what's in your mod. Um, now I, this isn't definitely not a portable charger, but there's two settings. Uh, you have all six, or you can do uh, at 0.5 ohm. I mean, at 0.5 amps, and then you have two, I believe, at two amps. So they'll charge really fast if you need a quick charge on a battery. Mm -hmm. uh, and they do 26 650s mm -hmm. as well. Uh, which is very important. Well, this deal has been up on your blog now. Today is day three. Um, uh, Lisa is reporting there's a few things out of stock. Yeah, there will yeah. be. Uh, this is day three, <laughs> but um, definitely still worth checking out if there's something there that's uh, priced right for you. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing we can we can really you know do about that. You know, you put a deal up, things will go out of stock. Yeah. Um, I'm just looking at batteries. All right, like you know, their regular batteries are still there. Uh, LG HB2s, the LG um, HE4s are still in stock. Uh, they got the brown ones. They got the coffee ones. Uh, coffee ones are out of stock. Mm -hmm. uh, but let's see here. Uh, it looks like the 25Rs are still stocked. Uh, yes, 25Rs are still in stock. Those are good. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. Which ones though? Wait. Uh... Only the button tops, though. Only the button tops are still in stock for the H, uh, for the um, 25 bars. So if you have Provary, <laughs> yeah, I don't know uh, how compatible button tops are with a lot of our mods these days because you get that little extra bit of room because of the button. Uh, but uh, I'd stick with the flat tops. Uh, let's see. As far as batteries, um, well, you got the um, HB twos, which are nice. Or the thirty amp. Uh, they have their low mod though, the fifteen hundred. Yeah, go away. Be too low. Let's see here. Batteries. Now here's a battery I've never heard of. H ohm, homegrown. They're called. Anybody here have used uh, H ohm or homegrown uh, batteries? before no watching because i'm looking to see if we have any yeah they have the 26 650s which are 32.3 amps uh let me just see what their 26 650s are doing uh they're still in stock they're 21.5 amp at wow they're so exacting 2531 ma <laughs> oh wow okay well <laughs> how exacting of you look cool though oh lisa said she ordered a set so she'll let oh. us know after she gets them cool okay cool. you do that yeah and there's a bunch of other things there it's not like i said uh battery chargers they their night core i bet is gone yeah the night cores are gone they went quick because that night core uh, i4 was cheap uh it was only 15 bucks and that one's gone um that 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 
Bluetooth charger. And I have to tell you, the Bluetooth charger is kind of cool. Uh, you know, it hooks to your phone, has an app, oh, and you yeah. basically can see the charge levels on your batteries over your phone. I think it's cool. Um, I mean, you can kind of... Now, believe it or not, <clears throat> it's actually easier to see on your phone than it is on the charger itself because the charger's display goes one at a time. Boom, boom, boom. Like, really slow through all six. So when you use the app, you could just... Boop, you could see what the charge levels are at. So it's actually kind of neat. Um, but uh, anyway... Head over there. You only got about an hour left. And of course, it's uh, Lightning Vapes. They're a great company. They make great wire. Um, you know, especially if you're a rebuilder. I've been uh, pimping um, Lightning Vapes even before they had a website. They're on just eBay. Uh, so uh, head over there and check it out. Now, I have to squirrel for just a second. I'm seeing comments in chat, uh, folks trying to order the Vapor Flask Classics. And Big Bam missed out. He ordered two, but they ran out and they were unable to fill his order. I'm sorry, Big Bam. Uh, Anti said he was going to get one, but all they had was white. Um, you know what? Don't worry about the color. Grab yourself one of those. That's a great deal. And hello, J Raps. You can make it look however you want. He does such a beautiful job making the wraps. Elon is so skilled. Everything always fits yeah. so perfectly. So, you know, just black, white, you know, purple with pink polka dots. It doesn't matter. Uh, make it look however you want. And you've got a great mod. So. And I have it white. Um, you know, and to be honest with you, white mods are actually kind of cool because there's not a whole lot of them out there. Most people get basically black or silver. Uh, I have mine right here. Actually, it's right here. Look at that, my white one. And anybody up there uh, who buys these, I, like I said, you will be impressed. You're going to be like, I got this for like $38. It's fucking amazing. Um, you're going to really love this mod. Don't let the color bother you, man. Just go over to j Raps and get yourself something. I can't even believe this deal's still going. Now, there is a question in chat I'll throw at you. Vapor Joe, have you seen the new player mod? It's modular, sort of build your own with modular parts. Uh, runs 80 bucks at Vape NW. Uh, question from Kieran. Let me see. Let me check oh, it out. oh, he's, he's going to go look right now. Player mod, Vape NW. It's called the player box mod. I think that would be a player mod. It's a it's a modular kind of idea. Well, I see a player DNA one thirty three. That's. Uh, hold on. Let me look it up. I'm not seeing. Oh, I see. I don't. I don't think it's really modular. I think what you're seeing is the player mod, but then you're seeing like buttons and um, like different pieces, but I think they're replacement parts. I wouldn't really call it modular. It's, is it $119? Because that's what I'm seeing at Vape NW for the player. And I'm um, just looking at it right now. I'm doing uh, the same. It uses, you know, the problem is these use the older uh, lipo batteries and the lipo batteries are awesome but the ma rating on them is terrible now the reason why the lipo batteries are great is because the power is so good like they pump a lot of a lot of amperage but because of that you lose ma so what happens is you got 1100 ma well in terms of it being sort of semi-modular what they also have uh they they're, they're for seven bucks you can get a 18650 battery case and you can use 18650s in it instead of the lipo oh okay yeah okay I see what you're talking about. Yeah, six ninety nine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So it's kind of interesting. You can change it up a little bit. I don't, as as Joe said, I don't think I would call this truly modular, but it does give you some, you know, like like to yeah. deck it out your way options. I guess you could say. Right. And what's going to happen is this is why it's a it's a DNA one thirty three or two hundred. If you lose the lipo bag, you'll be able to go to two hundred watts. If you use the two eighteen six fifties, you're going to stick. You're going to drop it to one hundred thirty three. Uh, Which, either okay. way, doesn't really fucking matter to me, because 133 watts is plenty. I have a 133-watt H cigar, which I don't ever go past 80 watts on. Right. Uh, so, but it's cool mod. Yeah, that is really interesting. Yeah, I have one. Um, I have this one here, the VT, 
the VT Box 200, uh, which uses the LiPo bag. It's great. It's super powerful. It's awesome. The problem is the LiPo bag that makes it go to 200 watts. Um, it's 100, 1100 miles or 1300 miles. So it, for me, it's dead in two hours. You know, mm -hmm. especially these guys out there who are pushing hard on their mods. I mean, on their uh, on their uh, rebuildables, you're going to kill that battery fast. But mm. on the other hand, it'll charge fast. So, mm -hmm. you know, they're probably charging less than an hour. So, hmm. so that's that on the uh, on that particular mod. Um, so where do we scroll out from? We scrolled, uh, out, we from scrolled out from Lightning Vapes. We scrolled out from Lightning Vapes. Yes. yes. <laughs> okay. So let's do another juice deal. Um, All right. Here is another one from, this is from Mount Baker Vapor. Um, they're doing a 15-15 sale. It's 15% off all 15 mils, uh, which basically you're going to get 15 mils of juice for $3.87, uh, which again is another good deal, uh, another way to try their juice. Now, Mount Baker Vapor has been around forever. Um, I am in love with, and I'm not lying, I'll prove it to you. Um, I'm in love with a, a juice called Grapple. Okay, that's how much I love it. I buy it in these big bottles from Mount Baker Vapor. I uh, also I have a big bottle of what's known as Freckled Lemonade. Um, now I remember what Freckled Lemonade was a uh, beta flavor, and they sent me it, and it was amazing. Uh, so um, I was sitting around, and I'm like, you know, it's some. This is during the summer. I was like, it's summery. I'd love to have a lemonade for vape. Uh, I didn't have any, so I was like, you know what? I'm going to Mount Baker Vapor, and that day they had a deal on the 200 mil, uh, 236 mil bottles. So I bought a 236 bottle of Freckle Lemonade. It's great. It's kind of like, basically it's lemonade with flecks of strawberry in it. That's why it's called Freckle. Mm. Uh, they make an amazing candied apple. Um, their, their candy apple is probably one of the best in the industry. It's really good. Um, they make, um, what is it that's really good? I love their absinthe flavor. It's a true sweet absinthe. I really, really, really enjoy that. My favorite thing to do is to do their customization area where you can add flavors and make your own juice. So one of my favorites is blood orange, black licorice, um, and sweetener. Lots and lots of sweetener, which comes out as an orange uh, black licorice, which is fantastic. And then um, um, you could just make, I mean, you could put bacon and dill pickle together. There's all kinds of crazy stuff you could, you could put in there. Uh, but um, but anyway, uh, for those of you who just want to try their flavors, another one real popular is Hawk Sauce. Uh, I'm not a fan of that, but it's like one of their favorite uh, big flavors over there. Um, but uh, for $3.86 or whatever it is for 15 mils, you can't go wrong. And you can buy multiple bottles. Uh, and you can um, uh, try lots of different flavors to see mm. uh, you know which ones you like. Now, it looks like they don't have the freckled lemonade anymore, Joe. No way. Um, well, I, I'm not having any luck finding it. I started looking because uh, one of the viewers said they couldn't find it. So uh, I was going to try and give him a no link. No I'm coming up short. Discontinued, maybe? No. I'll be very upset. Shit, man. That's not fair. Aww. Yeah, Joe's sad. I am. <laughs> Damn it. Well, mine's worth a lot of money now. Anybody want to buy 10 of them? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, always an opportunist. <laughs> Uh, you know what it is. I, I'm sure you can you can email them and ask them about it because this is, it's a great flavor. I am pissed off though. That is like like one of my favorite juices from them. Um, anyway, going through their juice though, like I said, they oh and Thug Juice. This is another one. If you guys like menthol, if you're a menthol lover, you will love Thug Juice. Thug Juice is so mentholated that I use it. I use that juice to mentholate other juices. So like the juice itself is it's almost like a, a, a menthol concentrate. It's supposed to be uh, a watermelon blueberry menthol. To me, it it's it's just like nose and mouth like cleaner. It's so heavy mentholated. So if you're into that heavy heavy menthol, and it's got 2,434 reviews uh, with almost five stars. Okay, so this is a huge seller. So. 
if you're into that uh, heavy, heavy menthol, man, you, you will love bug juice. Tucker, did you ever try that? No, I didn't. Uh, but Condensation is saying, uh, Joe, would you say it's good for when you cannot taste your other vapes? A lot of people swear by that. I do as well. Um, you know, don't go crazy, crazy, but a, a good, a strong menthol, something with a good presence of menthol in it will help sort of like, I don't know, reset your palate. It, it, it cures that vapor's tongue thing where you, nothing tastes good anymore. Uh, switch to something mentholated. And then when you come back to your other juices, you can kind of rediscover them all over again. Oh, they have a non-mentholated juice now. They took the tea It's called hug, hugs, uh, hug juice. So thug juice. Aww. I need a hug now because my freckle lemonade isn't there anymore. Aw, muffin. Oh my god, she called me muffin, guys. Yeah. Um. Anyway, so uh, get over there, check it out. Like I said, uh, 15 mils. But basically, what it is is they they discounted it down to 4.25 for 15 mils. Then you use the Vapor Joe's coupon, which takes another 10% off, which gets it down to three and change a bottle. Um, and uh, you'll love Mount Baker Vapor. I love Mount Baker Vapor. And Vapor Joe's coupon works on the entire site, not just on juice. So if you go to their clearance section or if you go to their, um, their, their um, you know, uh, vape devices or what have you and their uh, RDAs and stuff, uh, it works there too. And again, that's a coupon that never expires. So that's the juice. How, how's, your, how's, your, uh, how's your peach? Ah, uh, nice. I actually like it when the ice melts into it and Tiger, waters it. Tiger down. has a nice peach. Oh, brother. <laughs> oh, how's the peach? Was good. <laughs> What's the next deal, Joe? <laughs> Jeez. I'm trying to break Tiger's. Yeah, That's well. Like She's gonna yell at me. Oh boy. Damn it! That thing is out of stock now. That was a cool, um, cool deal, but it's dead, so I can't. I can't that about. tends to happen when something goes on the blog. It does. Like Eva said earlier, that's kind of the point of a sale is, is to get rid of stock. Yeah, <laughs> I know. But I mean, sometimes it's just like, sometimes I put things up and I know they're not going to sell well, but they're going to be useful for, to vapors. Like mm -hmm. what I was talking about was this new smoke. Um, well, it's not new, but it's called the smoke vape pen. Now, that sounds stupid, doesn't it? It's like, who the hell wants a fucking vape pen? Well, it's not really a vape pen. I don't know why they're calling it that. Basically, it's a, um, it's like this hybrid battery with a, with a dual-coil tank on it. It almost looks like a Clieto on the top of it. And, uh, you know, it's 1600 ma. It's 15 bucks. I'm like, this is amazing for new vapors. It's the super simplest thing ever. You don't need to, you don't need batteries. You charge the thing with the micro USB. You twist off the top. You dump the juice in. You're good to go, and you're vaping. And you're going to get good clouds for for something uh, you know much better than an ego. Right? So for fourteen dollars, I mean, this would have cost like three hundred bucks when I started vaping. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, so uh, but it's gone now. I didn't think it was going to sell that well. Apparently, it did. Okay, let's see now. I got to go through Tuesday, Monday. That one's dead, okay. The wire deal is dead. Oh, here's something we could talk about. Uh, this is actually important. Um, All right. Let's just see if the uh, deal's still going. Well, sure. Where are we here? This is actually something I spoke to Gearbest about personally. Let's see if she's still working. Why do I just have to log in, right? <laughs> That's the one thing I hate about Gearbus. They won't let you do anything until you log in. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, it's still there. Good. All right. So. Okay, so there's this new mod coming out. It's called the iJoy Maxo Quad. Okay. Now, what this is, uh, is a new, um, a new mod from iJoy. Now, it almost looks like an RX200, but it uses four 18650s. Now, this mod, everywhere I went, was like 80 bucks, 100 bucks, 80 bucks. Um, and then and I went over to Ephon Top, and they had it for $59. I was like, okay, it's, I, I see you can go lower. I hit up, um, well, 
Gearbest talks to me almost every day. They want to, you know, they always throw me things. Oh, you should put this up. You should put that up. I talk to their people. And um, basically, I said, listen, this is going to be a new mod. It's going to be a big mod. I think it's going to be very popular. Uh, anything with lots of batteries, people like. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's basically, you know, it's almost like an RX 200. Just add another battery, basically. Um, but it's too expensive. It was like 80 bucks on their site. I said, nobody's going to spend 80 bucks on that. We didn't get RX 200 for $39, you know? Uh, so I spoke to them, we went back and forth. Finally, they gave me a coupon code uh, and drops it down to forty-seven ninety-nine free shipping. Oh. Uh, now this is still um, on pre-order, I believe. Uh, this ships. Yeah, this is. It's going to take a while to get it. It ships October tenth. Okay. Um, but they are, now have all the sexy colors. If you look at them, uh, they got the um, they got the sapphire blue, which really looks nice. I don't know, Tiger, if you're looking at it. I am. Um, uh, not the color. I've just got the picture from your blog up right now. Okay. Well, they have they have different colors. When I first put this deal up, they only had two colors, black and gold. Oh. Now they have the red. They have the yellow. They have the sapphire blue. Now, uh, remember, some colors take longer to get. Sapphire blue is August. Uh, was October 21st. Oh, well, I, uh, I don't know. That might be worth the wait. I'm kind of uh, curious. But the red that. one, just, which looks nice. Just headed over to have a look now. Like the red one, which looks nice, is still October 10th. Now, remember, this is a $315, uh, 315 watt mod, okay? So it's very, very uh, powerful, okay? This is not your typical 200 or 220. This is 315. I don't know who needs 315 watts, uh, but if there is somebody out there who, who will vape at 315 watts, go for it, man. <laughs> and it's going to be a big mod. Literally. It, it's going to be a big mod. Like I said, this is 418 650s. So that's the black there. Let's have a look. There's the golden, what they're calling golden, with that uh, that textured uh, panel. Uh, yellow. Oh, so very, very bright and sporty. That one's kind of cool. Got the checker plate. Here's the red you were talking about. Oh, very, very vibrant also. I like that one. And let's check out the blue. Ooh, that's kind of pretty. That's kind now, of pretty. Those side panels, these weird side grippy panels that you see, could be removed and you can change them up with different colors. Mm. Okay. So uh, apparently you can do all kinds of weird changes and interchanging different things to make it look the way you want or what have you. Uh, but uh, iJoy is, you know, been around a long time. Uh, and they use something called the iWePow. <laughs> <laughs> the the what? I we pal chip. I W E pal. I we pal. Okay. <laughs> it sounds like you're trying to say something that my son would say. I we. Uh yeah, it's a special chip. Um, it's supposed to be very accurate and doing all kinds of things. I don't know yet. Uh, but um, but like I said, uh, it's it's if you if you scroll down, you can see the guy's actually holding it in his hands. It's a big fucking mod. This is this is a. This is a Vapor Joe style mod. Now, am I going to get this? Probably not, because I don't need it. Uh, but uh, if you're into big, huge mods and you want 315 watts and you want the latest and greatest and you want to, you know, show off to your friends or whatever, it's worth it for 30. I mean, for 47 bucks, it's about the same price as an RX 200. Right. These I was days. just going to say that, but uh, quad instead. Hmm. Interesting. Right, and if you're like me and you vape uh, only, uh, you know, 40 or 50 watts, this thing will last a lifetime before you got to charge it, you know? And I do like uh, the battery door on the bottom. Um, it's just kind of like a pop-off and you just stick them in. Because this thing can get loose sometimes. You know, the side, these side panels here on the RX200, they can get loose. I kind of like the, the battery doors on the bottom, as long as they're the ones that open and not the screw-on ones. Mm -hmm. But that is that is going to be the I think is going to be an extremely popular mod. It's going to be the next RX two hundred. Hmm. You know, especially at these prices, right? All right, so that's that. Now, I'm kind of annoyed because this particular uh, juice deal is still good, except it's more expensive, slightly more expensive. Uh, we missed it on last show because this came out after the show, and the deal ended before this show. I talked about it a little bit on Mod Envy, and this is the Crystal Skulls uh, juices from uh, from Plug and Vape. Okay. 
Now, I'm going to throw it up here. That sounds bad, too. All right. I'm going to throw it up here. Oh, thank you, Big Man. Now, it says on my blog it was $13.99. It was $13.99. Uh, and it was such a great deal, I bought two packs. Um, uh, but the deal is over. And it's back, to, well, it's not back to its original price. It's still, you're saving, it's still, it's still cheap. It's $17.99 now. And basically what you're getting is you're getting two um, crystal skull bottles of juice. They're 40 mils each, so you're getting 80 mils. Uh, one is after party and one is cameo. Both are like candy flavors. One is like a melted gusher and it's like sweet and sour. And then the other is a strawberry watermelon uh, sweet uh, flavor. And so they're candy both... flavors, they're definitely doing Halloween treats here for everybody. Right. And the way I look at it is this. Um, it, I wanted to throw it out there because Halloween is coming and it's just a cool little uh, a novelty. Uh, I love the crystal skull bottles. They've always been my favorite. Um, and, I, you know, it's just cool. And it's still a good price. You know, 40 mils for, what are we looking at? Uh, nine bucks, right? Is that what it comes down to? About nine bucks, yeah. So nine bucks for 40 mils. That's that's reasonable because even 30 mils for 9.99 is reasonable in my book. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you're getting you're getting for nine bucks for an extra 10 mils, and you're getting cool bottles, and they come in this cool pack, which is nice. Uh, I should be getting mine any day, so I'm very interested. But I can't wait. Now, I bought one for me, and I'm sure I'm going to like the flavors. I bought a pack for Tiger. Tiger said. She's not sure if these are her profile. So what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to let her try mine. If she doesn't like them, I'm going to give away the second pack to, I don't know, maybe we'll do it on Done Deal or something. Yeah, you never uh, know. We're full of surprises. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh, but th these are, like I said, they're $17.99. Totally worth it, I think. Even though they're $4 more than when I did the deal. Mm -hmm. But you know what? You snooze, you lose. You got to deal with it. You know what I mean? No pun intended. But I have been doing so many freaking juice deals, I have to tell you. My blog is primarily hardware, but juice has been just off the chain lately. Everybody's doing deals now on juice. But that's all good for you guys. <clears throat> all right, give me one second here. Just keeping an eye on chat. Uh, one of the viewers said the... Um... The, the GearBest coupon code wasn't working on that iJoy mod, but we're wondering if he was signed in. So we'll just wait and see. Well, I have it working on mine. I yeah. just put it in. Maybe it only works on certain colors. Mine black, mine's black in the car. I didn't try oh, any other Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Try the different colors and just see if it's across the board. It's not working. There's got to be a reason. Cause... Yeah, maybe it's just... Um... It's a color thing. I don't know. The race it is, damn it. All right. Let's see what else we got out there. Uh, Wednesday. Okay, so let's talk. All right. Um, that's out already. Damn it. I gotta start putting up more deals because they keep going out before the damn show. Either sold out or they stopped doing it. Okay, uh, let's talk. Let's see if it's still working. to cart. Talk to me. Yes, this one's working too. All right, so this is for the Alien. Uh, this this mod's cool. Um, this is the new Smoke Alien. Um, I'm just gonna, sh give me a sec here. I'll chuck that in the room. This big man gets into it before me. I'm, I'm certain he will. <laughs> nope. I got it. Uh. Um, no. This one came out on Monday. Uh, this is another one I was talking to Gearbest about. The alien's cool. Yeah. One thing I love about it like is the display one. on this thing. Mm -hmm. The display on this is beautiful. It almost so looks crisp. like it's fake. It almost looks like um, it's like a sticker on there. Um, and uh, these are 220 watts. They use um, 18650 batteries. Like I said, gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous display. Now, the, the, ha the, the button is actually the whole side of the mod itself it's a yeah. grip it's a grip fire right here now, that that piece uh, right there yeah now tiger has a grip mod 
I she do. The... It's old school. Made by the same people, so obviously they just took that great idea and applied it to a new, very, very, very stylish uh, design. But they were doing that on the X Cube 2, where the entire side is the firing button. You basically, I wasn't sure if I would like that at first, but once you hold it in your hand and all you have to do is just squeeze lightly to fire, you find out that's pretty awesome, actually. And, uh, you know, since I have this in my hand, I, I really owe it to them to vape it. So I think most of them know what this is. What is it? Oh, no. Why did I open my mouth? Oh, why did I ask? Oh, it smells like skunk and pissed. <laughs> oh, it's terrible. Tastes delicious. Tastes like I minty don't... cocoa wonderfulness. Yeah, it's, uh -huh. it's all kinds of good. Yeah, I'm sure but, it is. But yeah, the, the whole side <laughs> fire button, I like that because there's no button to push. You just hold it in your hand lightly, and when you want to vape it, you squeeze it. Uh, now, the black, uh, my favorite, honestly, when I look at it, it's either the gold or the red. Uh, there's other colors, I believe. I don't know if they have them up, but they have a blue uh, tiger that smells like shit. Let you oh, know that. but it tastes so good. I know. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, I'll get you back. Uh, now, yes, they have a they have a black they have a black a bl on black. Well, actually, they, I don't want to know calling it black. It's more like a like a, a gunmetal silver and black, and then they have a gold. And they have a red. To me, out of all of them, I like the gold. I'm a. Anytime I buy something like uh, iPads, iPhones, it's always going to be the gold. Or uh, mods, I love gold trim. Uh, you know, all that kind of stuff. If, if they have a pure gold color mod, I just, I just love them. Uh, so if I had to pick, it would probably be gold first, red second, and then the black. Uh, great price though, uh, 50, 50 bucks. Um, and uh, these ship in four days. Uh, and uh, again, 220 watts. It's not a huge mod, um, and again, side firing. So, um, no, no, it's that. It's actually pretty damn gorgeous. Are you kidding me? Hold on here. What's that? Shaking it? Don't tell me they're back into the shake with this thing. Remember the shake? They used to have mods I shook. Yeah, I just, I don't There's know. There's a picture. There's a picture. I'm going to put it in the room. Uh, so it'll make it for everybody easier to find. Give me a sec here. This is the picture. I hope this works. Uh, yes. You see on the bottom, Tiger, if you can click the link in the room. I will. It shows a shake and it goes variable wattage modes t temperature control modes does that mean it's a shaky thing where you go like this with it to change the switch i hope not uh it does appear that you may be right i'm not 100 uh, percent sure on that but yeah well I used mm -hmm. to hate that with the remember where you'd, you'd go to what you wanted and you'd go like this and go to what you wanted and you'd go like this and like the big um damn it's been so long oh yeah i know which one you're talking about because it took me forever once i got the hang of it i i had it figured out but um yeah tilt to change uh big bam's calling it and oh, uh God. you know it's just i think I never really got that used to it as part of it, but. Mm, yeah, but still. I mean, if uh, you get used to it or whatever, I uh, just, that, that's a deal breaker for me. Um, you know, as much as I want people to, you know, buy awesome mods and stuff, that is a deal breaker for me. Well, I don't know that it was that big a deal because with me, I tend to set one up to work with a certain atomizer and I pretty much leave it alone after that. But, you know, we'll see. Okay. Um, now, we got about 10 minutes or so left. I just want to see what's up here. Uh, enter. God, product is not available. Why do you do this, people? Eva has a good point. It's harder to accidentally change the wattage, not like, uh, you know, when you leave it in your pocket or something and all of a sudden you're vaping at 150 watts. 
Now, this to me, right now, this isn't actually um, a deal. Right now, this is more of an area <laughs> okay. because um, let me get to it. And it's actually not up on my blog, but I'm going to do it tomorrow. I'm taking the day off, so because I hit 88 million. Uh, but I'm going to put this up uh, probably the next day. Of, but here's a link um, to the clearance section at 101 Vape, and there's a mod there that looks pretty decent for the price. I know it's only 35, only 35 watts, but it's $11. Okay, super super cheap. Uh, let's see, they have it. Red is in stock. Gray, silver, and blue. Black is out. Is not in stock. Now I know you're gonna go. Oh, who needs 35 watts? Not a lot of people in the world. But I can vape 35 watts. But this is a great um, mod for new vapers. It, like I said, it's 11 bucks. Yeah, nice um, gift for eight. somebody you know that you've been wanting to inspire. Yeah. Now, the, the area that I... The, this is just one mod in the area that caught my eye. Uh, hey, Tiger, you want to crack in for three ninety nine? dollars um, Well, there was a time. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. As as far as a, as a Jenny goes, the Kraken was awesome. Yeah. Um, let's see. They have, uh, they have the Aqua. Unqua? Aqua? Um, now, a lot of the stuff in here is old school. Okay? It's the truth. Uh, but uh, they have legit, legit... Patriots for 34 bucks. Remember, these are like $120 a piece. Mm -hmm. um, there's a really good price on the Fuchai in here. Uh, $39.99 to 213 watt uh, device. I have it in gold. This one's orange. You can only get it in orange. Uh, but for $39, that is a hell of a deal. Uh, if you don't mind that. Again, you can always get a wrap. <clears throat> and there's five sure. pages in this bitch. Uh, let me just get the picture of that one out. There should be. Um, let's see what else. Uchai I two thirteen. If you're into uh, Cosmic Fog, um, they have fifteen mils for five dollars and ninety nine cents. That's super cheap for Cosmic Fog. They have Kryptonite. They have the Shocker. Let's see what else they have. Uh, they got uh, Euphoria uh, for five ninety nine for fifteen mils. Again, that's super super cheap. Um, that's out of stock. Just going through their clearance real fast. Um, fuck it, 49 cents for e -juice? Give me a break. What? Oh, that's because there's only 18 or 24 milligram left. <laughs> let's see, what else do they have here? Page 3, let's go to page 4. Now, guys, see what I'm doing right now? This is what I do every day. Mm-hmm. Looking in clearance sections. Hunt for and... deals. Um, well, I got some batteries that aren't too bad. I mean, not batteries you're going to use for um, high-end mods, but they got E-Fest's uh, uh, 18500s, 15 amp, $3.49. That's a good, nice deal. Uh, for those of you who have Pro Berries, uh, they have a 10.5 amp 18350 for 399 and then they have its its non button top uh, version for two ninety nine. Mm -hmm. uh, these aren't bad prices uh, if you wanna um, if you're looking for uh, batteries for. I mean, you can use a fifteen amp battery in variable wattage devices. You just can't go high. You know, fifteen amps will do good, like a, like a thirty watt mod, you know, or what have you. But there's not many thirty watt mods out there that are using eighteen five hundreds or eighteen three fifties anyway. Uh, but uh, like I said, great for pro berries and stuff if you use the small ones. Anyway, so that's that uh, on the clearance section. I just wanted to throw that out there. They have a ton of things there for two bucks, seven bucks, five bucks, all kinds of uh, different prices out there. But that thirty-five watt box mod, pretty good for eleven dollars, and it's one on one vape. They're awesome. Oh, Ty, uh, Big Bam's reminding me they have the cats atomizer. I like that one. Yes, me and Tiger used to fight over what we're going to post. And uh, when that went live, she's like, fuck you, I'm taking that. <laughs> well, duh. It's a cat atomizer. And, uh, you know, there are there are certainly probably higher output uh, RDAs out there. You know, oh, uh, more, 
more aggressive, but uh, for an RDA experience, I thought this was pretty clever because of where the airflow is. You can see the airflow holes at the top. Uh, so this was one of the ones you could take out of the house or and have tip over maybe even in your purse or something and you didn't have to worry about juice being everywhere because the air flows up here, it flows down between two sleeves and then in uh, from below and uh, so kind of a clever, clever design. I liked it and hey, it's got a super cool cat on it. Now, um, Condi's saying the alien is um, button control or tilt. Okay. Um, or, well, he's saying it's button control, so um, so I, you're not locked into tilt either way, whether or not they meant that. So there you go. Okay, uh, one more deal before we go, because we did we did start I, late. I, I, yeah. Okay, this is called the Battle Star. The Battle now, Star. um, yeah, I don't know how even how how do you spell how do you say that name? Is Smoint? 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 Yeah. Now, the picture I'm showing is this kind of uh, construction worker color. Yeah, it's uh, like it's loud, but it's fun. No, they actually have. Uh, I I'm going to call this the um, the stormtrooper edition. They have a white and black, which looks awesome. And considering it's called the Battle Star, this is definitely uh, the stormtrooper edition. <laughs> um, uh, with coupon code, it comes down to thirty dollars. Well, thirty and change, thirty-six or thirty-five dollars. It's a two hundred watt device. Uh, reminds me a lot of like it kind of has an RX two hundred feel to it. Uh, cheap uh, ships September thirtieth, uh, and um, well, the pre-order ends September thirtieth. It ships October second, uh, and of course, it ships free. I I, I almost want to get this this stormtrooper looking mod. Because like it's it's again it's called Battlestar, you know. Gotta get the white and black on the Battlestar. Well, it reminds me a little. You said the RX look to it. Well, of the RX two slash three, where you can use just the two batteries, where it's kind of they 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 basically lopped off this back part. Mm -hmm. So yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, now um, there's a coupon code. Coupon code. <laughs> Smoin it, whatever, S M O A N T 200. <laughs> oh. We'll get it to you for $36. Do that again, that was hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's the sound bite for tonight's show. <laughs> anyway, Absolutely. so this is, is this this is uh, cheap at 36 bucks again, 200 Walmart. Uh, ready to go out the door for 36 And again, it's called the Battlestar. And of course, the construction worker color is nice. Oh, uh, like. Chinook made my day. He just posted DeWalt. That's what it is. I used to be a roofer. Uh, my air nailer was a DeWalt, that wonderful bright yellow with black trim. So that's, that's why I probably like the yellow and black. It's, uh, it brings back memories. Yeah, absolutely. It looks like DeWalt vaporizer. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of, yeah, exactly. It, uh, it, it has a, con a construction worker roofer feel to it. Yeah. For sure. You could just hang it from a carabiner and be like, that's yeah, part of my equipment. <laughs> it's a vapor it's a vaping equip it's vaping slash nail gun. Yeah. All right. All right. Uh, well we have run uh, four minutes over. We usually open it up to questions. Are you ready to do that? Sure. sure. All right. Anybody got any questions? Yeah, anybody? 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 Let's see here. I'm just going to scroll back and see if there's any we missed. Do, do, do. Scrolling. No, today's word is peach. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's smooth. <laughs> no, you have the sound bite. I have the word. Ah, uh, okay. I, I can't even do it justice the way you did it. It was really quite funny. Oh yeah, and don't forget to check out Gearbus while you're on Gearbus. They have this big October, early Octoberfest thing going on. And the funny thing is, everybody who works at Gearbus, Gearbus does not look like any of these people in here. They got all like German people. I'm like, there's no Germans working at Gearbus. Um, but don't forget, Gearbus sells other shit besides uh, vaping stuff. Okay, uh, they sell a lot of cool shit. They got mini drones. They got fucking cell phones, tablets, VR equipment, cameras, all kinds of cool stuff. Robotic fucking vacuum cleaners. Everything you could think of over there. Uh, E-cigs are a very small part of 
what they actually sell. They're a lot like fast tech in that regard. Um, and um, so, you know, they got a ton of shit to look at. Not just, uh, not just uh, uh, vaping gear. I bought so many other things from Gearbest. Tiger's a big uh, China buyer when it comes to uh, cables. This girl's got most so many fucking cables. She's got a drawer full of cables. I'm not lying to you. It's just packed with uh, all kinds I of cables. I was brought up to always have the right tool for the right job. And uh, absolutely, I, I, I like to have the right cable for the right job. Tiger I, I'd love to show right off tool. the ones I just got, but I already put it in the truck. So... Um fancy little one that's got the micro and then it's got little snap overs that make it a type C USB or a iOS. Oh, so cool. Just does for everything we need. Um, and uh, I, I love it. Uh, we opened it up to questions and Max's first question was, does Joe have a deal on 87 octane gasoline? And uh, of course my answer was no, but since riding around in that H2, he should. Uh, yeah, the H2 sucks down gas. I uh, get up anywhere between 9 to 12 miles per gallon. It's oh awesome. I go down the street and I'm, I'm already out of gas. <laughs> anyway, uh, but um, but luckily, uh, gas is cheap in Jersey. So it's only like a buck fifty a gallon or whatever. There you go. Eva's backing me. She likes cables too. Right on. And drip tips. Yeah, but she ties men up with them and beats them. Well, That's you know, likes. a lot of people like that. No comment. Anyway. <laughs> uh, so, uh, anyway, I think that's it for us. Um, we'll Probably. see you uh, this Saturday, of course, on uh, on Mount Envy. Oh, and by the way, for those of you who are wondering if the guy claimed his prize on Vaping Underground for the Xbox, yes. And that's yeah. already been mailed out to him. He was pretty thrilled. So. so. Yeah, he's like, I'm crying. I won. I can't believe it. So, anyway, <laughs> that's out to him and, and everything already. So, no, there will be no second chance, guys. I'm sorry. But, of course, I'll come up with other, some other fucking weird giveaway. I feel like give away a drone or... No, I'll give away something. Some, some special thing's going to be coming up soon, I'm sure. You know, my, my vape... I think it's going to be my five-year. My five-year's coming up. Your five-year is coming up, what, in January? Yes, and Mod Envy's fourth year is coming up. Yeah. And then uh, we have yours coming up. Well, and, and the blog is getting dangerously close to 100 million. Yes, I'm going to have to do something for that. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'll give away 100 million M&Ms. <laughs> <laughs> and he's going to count them. <laughs> so. Yes, All right. Uh, well, then, on that note, we will bid you adieu to you and you and you. Yes, we'll see you, uh, we'll see you next week. And, well, actually, this week. Mm-hmm. All right. No, get out of here. Go to sleep. <laughs> Fuck off. Aww. All right. Nighty night, folks. See you later.